Hey guys, we're out here at Chacho 2023 and we're at the Gym Tech booth. Anthony, you guys got a lot of cool products. I know, it's, it's, we have a whole new line of 30 cal suppressors, 5.56 five, suppressors, a new mounting system, a, a reduced back pressure AR upper and complete rifle. So, I mean, it's, it's a lot, but we'll start here. So this right here is our new Neutron 762. It's a 30 caliber suppressor. So, you know, all your, all your calibers down from 5.7 to 300 Win Mag. We're testing for bigger calibers like 300 PRC and 300 Norma. So, I mean, there's nothing like a standard rifle you can't you know, put this on. Um, it uses our brand new Elite Taper Mount system, which also comes with the suppressor when you buy it. Um, and all you do is you simply line up the witness marks at 12 o'clock, rock it in, and you're all set. It's a taper mount, so it keeps the suppressor nice and aligned to the barrel. So get rid of those baffle strikes and stuff like that and keeps uh, fouling away from those locking recesses. So it really resists carbon lock quite well. Um, it's tubeless all welded design. It has five patent pending technologies, um, a brand new flash reduction system, new baffle design. I mean, it's nothing you can't shake a stick at. It's uh, super durable as well. It's rated down to a seven inch 556 five, full auto, seven inch 300, 300 blackout. No, it's actually a three inch 300 blackout. It's seven inch 762.39 and a 16 inch 300 wind mag. So, I mean, it's a pretty dang short 300 wind mag. So this will do most things. But yeah, it's just, it's the suppressor you want, you know, direct thread it as we have here, put it on your hunting rifle, super light, under a pound in that configuration, or you just put it on your gun, your, your, your AR, semi-auto or full auto and just have a ball. It's a phenomenal suppressor design. Over here, we have our Abyss 556 suppressor. It's a durability focused 556 suppressor design, but it can also do six mil calibers as well. Um, it's just, it's super durable. It's a reduced back pressure. If you can kind of see here, there's no hard walls between baffle and tube, and it constantly routes gas forward in and around the baffles. Each baffle is also individually vented so that it's constantly flowing through the suppressor. And then it uses, and then we use that flow to um, make our flash reduction system. So what that does is basically all those gases that are constantly being routed around the suppressor are blasting the back of this uh, end cap and it's seeping out of the sides. So we're creating an atmosphere in front of the suppressor that is already combusted so it can't burn anymore. And that's really what eliminates you know, flash from the first round to the last. It's really, really impressive to see. And um, again, comes with the, our Elite Taper Mount. Uh, comes with a muzzle device, all that jazz. So everything you need to put the suppressor on your gun, right out of the box, is there. You know, no need to you know wait for you know a muzzle device or a mounting system that's like not in stock or not at you know your dealer or distributor of choice. So it's just everything you need right there. And then we also, again, we also took a look at the AR design in general, and we wanted to improve it for suppressed shooting because let's face it, this is what the majority of us are suppressing. Um, and the stoner internal piston system from the get-go was not designed to be suppressed. It's no one's fault, it just wasn't a parameter at the time. So what we did is we leveraged technology from our Integra 556 over there to you know, make this a better uh, reduced back pressure system. And how we did that was the gas block and barrel. It uses a, what we call our GVAC, it's essentially a, like a bore evacuator on a tank or on a mobile you know, field artillery piece. And what it does is it adds an extra expansion chamber in the gas block so that only the gas needed to drive the rifle is being sent to the rear. And all that excess gas, which would be lingering the barrel and turn to you know, gas blowback, has a place to go. And then as the bullet leaves the muzzle, you have this high pressure gas in the gas block and that wants to travel forward because the front of that barrel is now a low pressure zone. So it moves all that gas in a forward direction and just takes that lingering gas in the barrel with it. And it works not just for our suppressor, but for everybody's suppressors. It's just a, it's a more comfortable way to shoot suppressed. And it's not something uber proprietary, you know, we're doing an upper, doing an upper, well, it is proprietary, that patent's locked up for like 20 years. So, good luck. So, um, but yeah, standard, you know, standard bolt and bolt carrier group in terms of its, you know, fit and function, no, you know, proprietary, you know, bolt lugs that you can only buy from me or from one other company. You know, it's, it's, we want to make the suppressed experience, you know, better for everybody. And um, we did some improvements to the bolt carrier group as well. We added some uh, grooves in the rear 
And what that does is we want to keep these bearing surfaces on the bolt here clean, as clean for as long as possible. So what this does is it gives oil and oil, you know, covered in, you know, debris a place to go. And that's off the bearing surfaces so that the bulk carrier group can, you know, cycle at the rate that it wants to and it doesn't slow down. So it helps to, you know, maintain that performance longer. And then we did the same thing with the firing pin as well. And we've added these, uh, these channels. And what the channels do is like a bolt carrier, we keep debris and stuff off of the bearing surfaces so that, you know, once you have a heavily fouled gun or you're in a dusty environment or that, you know, or if you're, you know, in the out west and you got that moon dust in Arizona that just, you know, wants to seep in, a, seep in every crevice, um, gives it a place to go so you still get those really strong, you know, firing pin strikes. So we bound, it's a new barrel profile, so it balances very, very well. We've shifted a lot of the, the, the mass rearward, so the nose, of the, the nose of the upper and the gun over there is really, really light, so it balances well with the suppressor on it. So we really tried to think about, you know, all those incremental, you know, improvements that we can do to, you know, take what's phenomenal about the system, but to just expand the parameters in which it, you know, performs phenomenal. So that's about what, and then we have a, whole range of mounting systems, end caps, the new muzzle devices for the mounting system. I mean, like, I mean, pick your poison. I mean, we're, we're coming out swinging at SHOT Show this year. Well, that is awesome. Yeah. Thank you so much for this interview. Yeah. We, uh, we enjoyed it, and uh, hopefully we'll be doing a review with you guys very soon. Absolutely, yeah. I know you guys are busy. Hope I didn't talk for too long. That was awesome. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. Thanks a lot, guys. Show. You too. Peace.